What is your biggest challenge as a trustee? As a trustee of Hungry Hearts Dog Rescue, we ensure the charity is managed transparently and sustainably. For example, we know we can't save hundreds of dogs each year, as we simply don't have the financial resources, or else the charity would fa fail in its mission. We'd love to save all the dogs locked away in the killing stations and on the streets, but we know we can't. And that probably is the hardest challenge to admit. What does fostering entail? Basically, it's to bring the dog into your home and to offer a loving, safe, warm environment for the dog. Um, to help the dog develop new social skills, for example, how to behave in a home, how to walk on a lead, how to be around other people and other animals. It's very rewarding um, seeing your dog um, develop into a happy family pet. What qualities do you need as a foster family? You don't need any special qualities to be a foster family. Just basic dog ownership skills. We always match our dogs with the um, environment and the skills of the foster family anyway. How long is a dog generally in a foster care? It depends really. Anything from two weeks to a few months. Once the dogs arrive in the UK into their new foster families, we assess them again and if we feel they're ready for adoption, we'll start promoting them right away. What would you say to people in the UK that are thinking of getting a new dog? It's so rewarding adopting a rescue dog. You really are saving a life and not just supporting a breeder who some only care about making money. Our dogs have rescue backup for life and we support the adopters all the way through. And if circumstances change and they can no, no longer care for the dog, it will always come back into our care. Why would a Hungarian dog take up precious places in British shelters? They don't. None of our, our dogs um, will ever take the place of a UK dog in a shelter. We only bring our dogs to the UK once they have a forever home or a foster offer. Mm -hmm.